Welcome back to a typical calendar time. I'm so proud of all of your hard work last week. You guys should be proud of yourselves too. So let's count our days. We've added quite a few. And whoops, this one snuck away when I was flipping them this morning. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It's the thirteenth. And let's clap our months. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. We're still in the month of April in the year 2020. And it's the 13th. I notice it's the first flip of our school week. That must mean it's, hmm, you know, it's been a little bit. Why don't we sing the song? There's seven days, there's seven days, there's seven days in the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Ah, today is Monday, today is Monday, all day long, all day long. Yesterday was Sunday, tomorrow will be Tuesday. Oh, what fun, oh, what fun. And we are in the turbulent, ever-changing month, well, season, these seasons and months are different, of spring. So the weather's been really, really wacky. Last week, there were days it was so sunny and nice that I went for my walk in shorts. And then it snowed. And then it was rainy and really, really windy. And yesterday, it was back to being nice. And today, it's really, really cloudy. But who knows what the weather's going to be like a little bit later. Let's sing that song, Weather Watchers. What's the weather like today? Let's take a look and see. What's the weather like today? Let's take a look and see. It could be rain. It could be snow. It could be sun. You never really know. What's the weather like today? Let's take a look and see. And I'm sure that you guys are going to be able to look out your windows and go outside today and see the weather changing like wild because it loves to change during spring. So, oh, Julius, it looks like you fell back over to take another little nap. That's okay. Do you know what we're talking about in Positivity Project this week? Um, we're talking about seeing the good in others. Yeah, Julius, yeah, we're talking about being able to recognize the good in our friends and the people around us. So today in particular, we're giving compliments and we're talking about compliments. Oh. I like getting compliments, and I like giving compliments. I have a compliment for Tony. Tony, you always have such great things to say. Thank you, Julius. I appreciate that. Julius, you always have such a positive attitude. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Tony. I appreciate the compliment. Wow, guys, those are some really nice compliments. And I just want to say to everyone who's here, who's sitting with me, or who's watching at home, you guys 
all have something amazing and wonderful to add to the classroom, whether we're there in person or we're here online. It's day one of showing appreciation and recognizing the good in others. So how do you show appreciation for the good in others? You work hard to identify and appreciate others' character strengths. The Other People Matter mindset is with us all the time. It's about having an attitude that helps you have a positive interaction with your world and the people in it. When you are tempted to judge someone, make an effort to see their goodness. Here's a quick video about how friends compliment each other about how they look or what they have. Hi everybody, I'm Heidi. Oh, and Emma, Emma. <laughs> and we are here to tell you all about the word compliment. Oh, Miss Heidi said that very well. Oh, thank you very much, Elmo. And you know what? What? That was a compliment. It is? Oh yes, a compliment is when you say something nice about somebody or something. Oh, Elmo sees. <laughs> you know what, Elmo? Yeah. I think let's give some more compliments. Okay. <clears throat> um, Elmo thinks Miss Heidi has a very, very nice voice. Ooh, thank you very much. That was a very nice compliment. And you know what? Yeah. I think that you have a beautiful, beautiful red fur. Uh, thanks for the compliment. <laughs> oh, Elmo thinks Miss Heidi is very pretty. Ooh, thank you very much. That is a very, very nice compliment. Thank you. And you know what? Huh? You have a beautiful green hat. Oh, all right, oh, all right, oh, oh, oh. all right. Emma, ah, you. I can't hold my tongue any longer. Oh. Enough with the compliments already. What an awesome boot. Huh? Whoa, did you hear that? Heidi Klum thinks I'm awesome. He is. What a compliment. I'm walking on air here. Oh. What is a compliment? It's when people say nice things about the way you look or the way you are or the things you have. Now, have you ever given someone a compliment? I know you guys love to give compliments in kindergarten. You're a very kind group of children. I hear you compliment each other all the time, and you would compliment me and the other teachers. Why do we give compliments? I know it feels good to receive them, but does it also feel good to give a compliment? I hope you have a great rest of your day. I love you and let's hop back into a week where we can learn and play and talk to each other. Bye-bye.